There, yep, there's the follow me. I feel like their Calyrex is slow. I'm the okay. How's it going, YouTube? So in today's video, we're going to be doing some ranked battles with my Coridon team. With this team, it mainly focuses around Coridon and Hisui Typhlosion with a mixture of Tornadus and anything else that I could be think, of, think to bring. I can't word today, but we're going to continue. Um, the main thing is that Coridon sets up the sun and Hisui, Hisui Typhlosion. I told you I can't speak. Hisui Typhlosion uses eruption. It's basically almost one clicks and they're dead. Um, if you enjoy the video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I really enjoy making these videos for y'all, and it's you know it just shows a little bit of support, and I really appreciate it. Uh, other than that, let's get into the video. Right, we're gonna do some ranked battles. Uh, I created a team. Uh, I've done a couple. I've done like twelve battles since this new uh, this month. I created a team. I don't remember if, excuse me, uh, if I've battled with it yet. So. It might be the first time everyone's seeing it. We'll find out. <laughs> yeah. Still like still got that annoying cough though. <laughs> um Oops, I almost joined a voice chat. <laughs> there we go. Right, fine. Hey, we found someone about time. <laughs> Da, 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 da. Okay. Um, we'll start with this and Yolo. Do I go all fire? I could go narwhal or brother bear. <coughs> Let's go narwhal. Okay. Audio input, audio output. It'd be an audio output. I'm just going to try this one more time. Oh, so the sun's gone. Uh, tailwind. Should I Terra just in case? Dragon Claw. I don't know if I want a Terra. I might actually. I'm gonna switch. Switch to a Titan here. Do do do. If I unmute this, nope, it just doesn't show up for some reason. Oof, that did a lot. If I turn this up, it's gonna be a little distracting. Um, just a blue wind. And then ice spinner. Ooh, good damage. Is it working? No. I don't know why. Got the replace, which is good. I'll stop. There we go. All right, since the Titan's gone, that's fine. The sun's still up. Let's bring Karad on for now. Just in case. And they got Urshim. Okay. So now, we can again, Terra, Legion Chorus, Cineroar. 
dark fighting. No. Yeah. Let's get Incineroar. Okay, yeah, go. <laughs> Alright, I go first still, so this should be in Singular Gone. Yep. Alright, so that's Urshifu, whatever their last Pokemon is. Within Storm. Infected. Oh! They only have one left. This is great. What's coming up? <laughs> uh, Gold Dango. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to switch out Tornadus into Typhlosion. Then we're going to hit him with a Flame Charge. He's going to Terra, which is fine. Oh, they quit. I'll take that too. <laughs> Little Water Break. Oh, some high quality H2O. Wait for it, wait for it. So you got that, and then you got, you got this. <laughs> so, I got that uh, today. No, not today. Recently. Um, let's see. Okay, so they're basically getting rid of abilities. So, I can do... I can do... Hmm. Getting rid of abilities. I'll want Tornadus. Try Ted. Um, Ogre Pong, because he can't lose his ability. And then right on in the back. Let's just see how this how this works. <clears throat> yeah, I've done a lot of cleaning. Uh, also, I've got a GameCube and a Wii now. Um, I've tried to get uh, Smash Bros. Melee a couple times now. And the ones I've gotten, they have not worked, so that sucks. But I do have Brawl, so I'm trying to get all the game, uh, Smash Brothers I've played in my childhood. <laughs> uh, I've also moved my Aquasoft logo to over on my desk. More for like me to see, same as my Pokeball and stuff. Just kind of cleaned out the rim a little bit. Alright, they got a Covert Cloak and obviously the mask. Okay. So we're gonna do is we're going to sunny day and then we're going to like i want an eruption but then i'm stuck in it and i feel like they're gonna go straight for my typhlosion here i can hope to be faster if i tear i'm grass so that's not gonna work so i'm just, I'm just gonna go for eruption why not yo what's up nacho honestly taunt not the end of the world um, if they go into a tornado here, that'd be beautiful. And they do. Honestly, I'm okay with that. Because this is a max eruption. Oh, that is beautiful. Uh, we got rid of their tornadoes. <laughs> so it looks like I'm faster than their ogre pond, which is great. Um, probably going to switch out. There's the Weezing. Um. Hmm. Ooh, actually, now I mean I'm still faster. No, I don't know if I'm faster. They might be faster now. I think I'll bleak wind, and then I'm not gonna I'm not gonna eruption. I think I'm gonna switch into Coridon or hmm. So Coridon. Let's, let's see what happens here. I know the sun won't come up, but the um, Ivy Cudgel shouldn't be as bad. I got one kill with the explosion, so... Not explosion, eruption. Protect, honestly, that is huge. Uh, that means I think they went to the Typhlosion here. Oh no, they went for the... Um, okay, that's fine. Interesting, but fine. I think I'm faster than the Weezing. 
And I think my Coridon is faster than their... Yeah, we're going to give this a try. And then Trust Lies here. And Dual Wing Beat into... Actually, we should be able to just... Yeah, we should be able to just do that. So that way I can get some speed with the Flame Charge. Uh, Fire Terror, so it's got more stab. Um, not more, but has stab. Because uh, then... <coughs> it'll do enough damage to kill the Overpong. And then we're hoping we're faster than the Weezing. Because if we are, Eruption should go off with max health, which would do a lot of damage. Maybe even kill. Unless it has Focus Sash. Honestly, not the worst case scenario there. Sure, I take a little bit of damage, but it, it could have been a lot worse. Thank you, Nacho, for the notice. There's the eruption. Oh, I almost got the wheezing. Focus Sash. Dazzling Gleam. Oh, that did nothing. I'm okay with that. Um, I should be able to do just another eruption here. And then Flame Charge into Ogre Pond. Let's see what happens. Uh, Nacho, how's my volume now on the microphone? There we go. <laughs> now, oh, they tried to double spiky shield. Okay. Uh, they probably, yep, they tried double protect. So, Eruption's not going to be doing as much anymore, but because I still have a good amount of health, it's still going to do a lot of damage. Doing that to get the speed boost, which I got. Uh, I should be able to get the Weezing now. Um... <laughs> With, uh, what's it called? Unless they get the double protect. And then they heal off the black, black sludge. Sludge. Jeez. I can't speak. Alright, they got a slacking. I need to, I need to get rid of the wheezing. <coughs> so, what we're going to do is we're going to eruption. And honestly, I think collision course is my best bet here. His collision course into the slacking. Possibly getting it down to if a focus sash if they have it. Sucker punch. E that stinks. Um I forgot what I brought in the back. Honestly, it's not the end of the world. There's the collision course. Does it kill? Oh, we're good. It's a slacking, not slacking, a wheezing with like no health. <coughs> Dazzling gleam doesn't do a lot. We won. <laughs> like, I'm not worried anymore. Um, I was scared with the, the neutralizing gas, but it honestly wasn't that big of a factor. I didn't need the sun. Um, I got the Oko on the... Um, what was it? I got the Oko on... Bro, words are hard. Let me focus real quick. Okay. I got the Oko on the Tornadus. Uh, and I got the Orgapon down to a one hit, so that was the best the card probably could have done with their, um, neutralizing abilities. <coughs> it's the one thing. See, now the sun happens. Because, <laughs> um, because Weezing's gone, I get my abilities back. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah, I was going to say, my team is really re not reliant, but their abilities help them a lot, especially um, Coridons. Being in the sun is super helpful because then the flame charge is more damage on top of the stab if I terastalize. But we got a second win. GG to my opponent. And we're getting some great, great, not experience, but I don't, I don't know what to call it. Um, it's been going good. Uh, I've probably created this team uh, a couple months ago. Not last month. It was like right after the tournament, I think, is when I thought of this team and decided like to start making it. So I tested it on um, Pokemon Showdown for a while, and I started you know getting consistent consistent work on it. So I decided to make it a game, and this is where it's gonna be rough. Um. Let's see. We're going to bring in this. And then... 
We're going to start like this. We're going to see what happens here. In the back, I want Brother Bear and probably Koridon. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so, <coughs> I have a feeling this is a Trick Room team. If not, either way, Glass Gear, um, Calyrex is really annoying. And my goal is to get that gone as quick as possible. So, the plan on the first move, Sunny Day Eruption. Um, oof. That's rough. So, if I Sunny Day now, they're going to get a boost. I think we still try. Um, there's the rain. They boost your energy anyways. So they act they activated part of the synthesis. That protosynthesis. So I should be able to sunny day now. And then eruption. Which isn't going to be very effective. So I, I probably should heat wave. Yeah, I'm going to heat wave. Let's see what happens. Oh, so, Eruption is based off of your uh, maximum HP, like percentage-wise, while Heat Wave, it has a chance of missing, but it doesn't matter what health I'm at. Okay, see, I missed Pelipper. That's fine. Um, I miss both. That's not fine. Um, that's okay. Not very effective. Let's see what uh, Thunderbolt. That's going to kill Tornadus. Yep. Dang. So that was an awful start, to be honest. Um, I'm really not sure how I'm going to pull this off. <coughs> like, I want to save Karadon. But at the same time, it's my best thing to pull out right now. They're going to withdraw Pelipper here is my guess. Sunlight's already up. Uh, so we're going to Terra. We're going to Dragon Claw the Raging Bolt, and we're going to do another Heat Wave because I have uh, choice specs, so I have to. And going into Urshifu right now just makes zero sense. I might lose this, but we're going to see. I'm going to try my best, as we always hope. There's my Terrastalize. Let's see if they do. So I went for the Dragon Claw since it's super effective. To hopefully whittle it down to at least like another hit. I don't think it's gonna one shot though. It's definitely not gonna one shot. <laughs> uh, here comes another weather ball. Dragon? No, that's me. Duh. Um, heat wave next. I think. Yeah. Do I hit the Pelipper this time? Let's find out. I do. Good. Do I get the burn? Cause that'd be cool. I do not. Hurricane misses. Nice. That was helpful. Okay, let's try another Dragon Claw. And another Heat Wave. I don't switch out a lot, so <clears throat> I think that's one thing uh, I need to work on is knowing when and when not to switch out. And really what to bring. Um, I know my team pretty well, but I don't know my matchups very well. There's the Withdraw of Pelipper. We saw that coming. Uh, next turn, I'll probably withdraw um, Koridon. There's the Terra. It's going to be Fairy. Or Electric. If it's Electric, I'm okay. If it's Fairy, yep. I was afraid of that. Because now, my Dragon Move won't do anything. Yeah. Dang it. Let's see if I get any damage. I get both. I got nice, nice, nice. Good damage. Do I get a burn at all? Nope. Don't die. Ah. <coughs> so now they are able to bring in Pelipper. And get the rain set up. Uh, which basically makes it to where my Karadon's dead. In a sense. Um, so what I can do. Probably should do that. No, because I feel like they're going to switch. Ah, screw it. Let's go for it. And then probably just Sucker Punch. Ah, we're going to have to... Yeah, we have to Sucker Punch. Now, let's just protect this turn. <coughs> See what happens. Is that me or them? <laughs> I don't know. Thunderclap on the Urshifu. That's huge. 
And then they use surging strikes. Oh, I survived. I tanked that. Because the sun's still up. It's not as much damage. So I should kill the Urshifu here. I believe. Yep, okay. Oh, I just lost audio. Did my headset die? Or can I just not hear? Let's find out. <laughs> Let's turn the headset off. Okay, headset's turned off. I still got audio playing, so... Whoa. There's Pelipper. Okay, let's see if audio comes back in my ears. If not, it is what it is. Okay. Um... I want to do Flame Charge, but we're in the... Okay, so what we do... It's not gonna do a lot. Okay, I, I can hear again. We're good. And then we'll Sucker Punch... Pelipper. Let's see what happens here. They use Protect. Honestly, that's fine. Let's see if I kill the... Uh... Yep, there goes that. Come on. I really need to get the Raging Bolt out of here. <coughs> Honestly, that's a great thing to happen. I missed the dual wing beat. That sucks. Okay, let's try again. Um, We're just going to dual wing beat again. We're going to Sucker Punch again. Yeah. Except this time, the Thunderclap will probably hit because Sucker Punch is going to hit. But Pelipper's gone. Thunderclap might miss. Unless they go into Coridon. Oh my gosh, they miss again. What is Thunderclap supposed to do? That's not doing a lot, but it hits twice. Which is good damage. Let's see what their last Pokemon is. Calyrex. Oh, that's right. Dang it. Okay, uh, I'm in trouble. It should be the slowest thing out here. So. I, I need to hit the Raging Bolt. And. Yeah, we're going to Wicked Blow. Get as much damage as possible and a crit. Okay. Not enough. I have a feeling I might lose now. I'm faster. Oh my gosh. I have a chance. A very slim one. But it's possible. <coughs> Let's see. Because it's ice. Which is not super effective into fighting. I am faster. Let's see what they do here. They do trick room. Okay. I think I have this. Okay. So if I sucker punch. No, I have this. So we're just, we're just going to do this, and then we're going to Sucker Punch. Because Sucker Punch should go first. And I think it's enough to kill. Yep, there's a Sucker Punch. We did it! <laughs> wow, okay, that... I did not expect that to happen. And they quit. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. That, honestly, I did not expect that to happen. I got really lucky. They should have set up Trick Room a lot sooner. <coughs> that that was the only way I could have won, really. <laughs> oh yeah, that's that's that's, that's my fiance. <laughs> All right, we found someone else. This is going really well so far. Um, this one I definitely need speed. Uh, that's a psychic type, so I'm gonna need dark. Uh, from there, let's go with Coridon and I'm feeling more Ogre Pond than, than, um, than Ted over here, but I'm not sure. Hmm. I could do Narwhal as well. No. Eh, let's go with Ted. Let's have some fun here done why not <clears throat> man they were they were ready <laughs> they chose before I did also I've noticed the cough flares up the more I talk so don't know why okay so they're gonna fake out 
Uh, and I'm gonna hope. I'm gonna hope they go for the Tornadus here. Probably not. But it's worth a shot. Because then if we go for Wicked Blow on the Latias. I, I would go into the uh, Urshifu. Yeah. Dang it. I mean, not really a dang it, but I should have saw it coming. <coughs> I probably should have used Detect. That way I would have a turn no matter what. There's Ice Beam. That's it. Oh, wow. That actually did not do a lot. I'm surprised. Um, Oblique Wind here. And then Wicked Blow this turn. Because I'm going to be faster than the Latios. Or, uh, ten, no, that's a Latios. Um, I should be faster unless they switch. They didn't switch. So this should be dead. Yeah, it's gone. Um, Incineroar probably... Um, if I had to guess, either Parting Shot or U-Turn. There's the Bleak Wind. Do I get the speed drop? I do. Okay, okay. Parting Shot. Oh, will use Knock Off. Okay, so I lose my safety goggles. That's honestly not terrible. Because they didn't have anything. <coughs> All right. Let's bring out Raging Bolt. Which probably has something with Fairy in it. There's the Protosynthesis. Hmm. Let's see. Probably want to Bleak Wind again. In close combat. Incineroar. Yeah, let's do that. Hopefully get the Incineroar off the field. And then maybe slow down the Raging Bolt. There's the Thunderclap. Yeah, I forgot about that. That stinks. <coughs> I get the bleak wind off. Do I drop either speed? There's the citrus berry. I don't think I dropped either of the speeds, which honestly, not terrible. There's the parting shot. And that, honest, also not terrible. <laughs> so on this turn, I'm going to go with Ted. Um, I'm going to go with eruption. And I'm going to throw in a sunny day. Just to see what happens. Um, I can't be faked out. There's the Calyrex. Um, so it's good that I still have... Um, what's it called? My Tailwind up. Because this is going to be very helpful. I might one-shot this unless they have... Um, uh, what's it called? Unless they have a Focus Sash, which I don't think they do. So Sunny Day and Eruption. I know it's not very effective into the Raging Bolt, but I need to get rid of this Calyrex. That's the thing that terrifies me the most. <coughs> but they might Thunderclap. This is a Fairy Terra. Yep. If they Thunderclapped my Typhlosion, I'm in trouble. Because that's going to do some damage. There's the Sunny Day. We're about to find out. Do I get it? There's the thunderclap. It failed. Okay. I got a pure eruption here. Do I kill either of them? Oh, yes. Oh, I needed that. That. Oh, I got the crit too. That was helpful. Calyrex gone. Whew. Calyrex is always terrifying to me. There goes my tailwind. So my tailwind did its job. I needed that probably to get past the Calyrex. And there's Incineroar. It has Fake Out. It can't hit my Typhlosion with it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to Tailwind again. To get that up. And I can either Eruption or Switch. I'm going to Eruption. Uh, just, why not? <coughs> is this, are these their last two? Oh no, you faked out me. I have Covert Cloak. <laughs> so my Eruption should go now unless the, I mean, they're going to do Thunderclap. So, oh, they didn't. Okay. Oh, <laughs> that is so nasty. Oh, I love it. That Yeah, that's all they have. Nice. Okay, we're going to Bleak Wind here. And Eruption again. Should win. Yeah, they quit. <laughs> oh, nice. GG. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to start with Tornadus. 
and Coridon. They're going to fake out on the Coridon. So I don't want Coridon. Probably want Urshifu. Nah, we got to stick with Coridon. Ah, I could go with Ted. Yeah, we'll, we'll start with this. We'll go Coridon in the background. And probably Narwhal is what I'm feeling. Yeah, we're going to get that shot. So the reason I went with Ted, I'm always worried about fake out. So if I put Tornadus and Typhlosion up there, then fake out doesn't matter because Tornadus has cover cloak, so secondary effects don't matter. And then uh, Typhlosion is ghost type, so it doesn't affect it. And I'll be doing Sunny Day and Eruption. That's kind of the combo, <coughs> which is also why I have on, just in case Tornadus dies. I can just use it on um, uh, Coridon. I had a feeling they were going to have Terrapagos, which is why I brought Coridon for the um, the fighting type. We just have to hope we're faster. Okay, they have Cover Cloak, which is good to know, and Citrus Berry. Oh, no. Intimidate. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Definitely Sunny Day. We got an Eruption. We don't have to. But it's the best combo. Uh, the question is, is their Terrapagos faster than me? There's the fake out. Not worried. I get the sunny day off. And this is where we find out. Okay. I am faster. Yeah, that's fine. Eruption. Still really good damage. Calm mind. Okay, so they're not they're not gonna <coughs> sorry they're not gonna die from this next one, which is fine because there's I mean there's special defense rises. I'm gonna get the tailwind off here, and we'll do another eruption. Um, to where I'm gonna be faster no matter what. Huh. They're gonna possibly Terra here actually. Yeah, I I messed up. I should have done another sunny day. Because then, I would have had the, um, the, what's it called? Uh, the sun still up. Because this is going to get rid of the sun. Yep. <coughs> Which, honestly, oh, they protect. That's, okay, that's fine. I f they're going to go into the Typhlosion here. Eruption. This is going to be the Citrus Berry on the Incineroar, at least. So, boom. Citrus Berry. Yep. So, wasted his item. If they don't go into Typhlosion here, they're dumb. Okay. Typhlosion's dead. Honestly, that's fine. Uh, let's see. We're going to bring in... What's it called? We're going to bring in... Coridon here. We're going to fire Terra. We're going to collision course into the Trapagos. Should one-shot it. <coughs> We're doing fire Terra, so I'm not weak to fairy moves. Uh, for Tornadus, we'll just Bleak Wind. And then here we go. This should kill Trapagos, unless they protect. Or withdraw. Honestly, I'm okay with that. Comfy. Not the best thing that could have happened there, but not terrible. They withdraw on Cinroar. Oh, do they just switch? They switched, yep. Oh, Ogre Pond. Oh, yeah, they still have all. Oh, this is super effective. If I hit the Bleak, the, the, the bleak Wind is super effective. Um, so that's good. So I've lost the Pokemon. They have theirs pretty low. It's going to be a close one, actually. I could see if I do a wrong move, I'm in trouble. Collision course. But this is a free turn, actually. Not very good damage, but free turn. Let's see what Bleak Wind hits both. That was good damage. No speed drop, which is fine. We're going to do another Bleak Wind here. And uh, probably Flame Charge into Comfy. Because Comfy is terrifying. Ah, Dual Wing Beat into Ogre Pond. I need to get Ogre Pond out of there. <coughs> Ogre Pond can do Ivy Cudgel. Which is super effective into my Coridon right now. Um, I risk 
leaving Comfey to heal it, but getting this out of here, yeah, that was my main priority. So Ogre Pond's gone. And only one dual wing base. That wasn't bad. And then Bleak Wind hits. Should kill. There we go. We got two kills there. Uh, bring back out Tropicos and Incineroar. <laughs> Which I think I have one more turn of Tailwind, if I remember correctly. There's a Tropicos, which should not get rid of the the sunlight. Yep, okay. And then Incineroar makes my Coridon a little bit weaker. But I think we're okay. I'm gonna... Yeah, I saw my Tailwind. That's huge. Bleak Wind again. Collision Course into Tropicos. Oh, I hit the Fake Out. Yeah. There's nothing I could have done there. I could have switched, but that would make sense. <coughs> Do I get a speed drop? Oop, sorry, I hit the mic. I got one. Only one. Okay. If Karadon survives here, I think I'm okay. Oh, we're golden. There goes the Tailwind. That's fine. Uh, Because we can throw it right back up. And Collision Course into Tropicos. They're probably going to protect. Uh, if I was them, I would. But, I mean, I think I'm okay here. I still have... They didn't protect! <laughs> Tropicos is dead. Uh, I still have Satitan in the back. No, I'm good. Yeah. That's another win. I think that's five wins in a row today. So, this is looking good. There's the knockoff. Oh, no. I lost the salt vest. <laughs> I'm still faster. So, Leak Wind and Collision Course. Yep, they canceled. <laughs> that, that actually went really well. Okay, so this looks like a Trick Room team. I'm going to need Tornadus here. Honestly, I want to say YOLO, but at the same time, I don't want to do that. What if I bring Coridon and Ted? And then in the back, I'll have... Hmm. It's the Titan. And probably Brother Bear. Yeah. I'm not going to bring Tornadus this time. Just because, like... I don't know. I could, I could see Ndidi using Trick Room. And then I'm just in, tr in trouble. <coughs> Ndidi does stop my Sucker Punch. So that's, that's going to be an issue. Uh, but I feel like Eruption is going to be very helpful. So if I could get that off. Yep, there's the Ndidi Calyrex. If I can get the Eruption off, I think I'll be okay. I'm going to fire Terra on Coridon. And I'm going to Eruption. See what happens. So it's a Covert Cloak. That's fine. And Psychic Seed. So they're going to get this special defense boost here. The real question is, who's faster? And I think the Calyrex might be faster. We're gonna we're gonna do this because they're gonna they're gonna go Ghost is my guess. I mean not Ghost, uh, Fairy. We're gonna double into it. They're probably gonna follow me anyways, so we'll do that. See what happens here. I tear it first, so if they're tearing, I am faster, which would be good. But they could still do, like I said, follow me and then redirect my flame charge. But flame charge will make me faster in the long run. They protect. Honestly, if I can get... Oh, yeah. That screws up the flame charge bit. So they're going to be setting up trick room here. There's eruption. <coughs> Let's see if we kill. But special defense is up, so I don't think we do. Yeah. And Trick Room. Yep. Dang. Huh. How do I play this? Because now I don't want to Flame Charge. But at the same time... Yeah, we'll Dragon Claw and we'll Eruption again. There, yep, there's a the Follow Me. 
I feel like their Calyrex is slow. I'm the okay. Honestly, that's the best case scenario. I don't know. Oh, they quit. <laughs> they quit, quit. That's hilarious. Wow. I did not expect that. I really thought that their Calyrex was going to be slower. I'm really shocked with that one. <laughs> I guess we'll continue battling. I said that get, got me to rank 9 still. Count it as a win. Okay. Eruption, I'm telling you. It's, it's really good if you can get it to work. I got a double kill with it, so that protect was not in their favor. <clears throat> and the follow me didn't matter. It was literally based off of who's slower in that case. Wow. I, I'm honestly shocked. I don't know what else to say. <laughs> Other than how long have I been streaming for? Because I feel like it's not even been an hour yet. And I've done like five or six games. <laughs> and they've all been pretty, pretty lengthy in my opinion. <clears throat> okay. This one I need speed control. So this will help. Hmm. I'm thinking here. Do you want Crydon or... Ted. Honestly, let's go Ted for fun. Right on in the back. And Narwhal. Ogre Pond. I haven't brought Ogre Pond yet. Why not? Yo, what's up, Chase? We've been having fun today. Uh, this might be my first loss. Uh, of the night game either five or six but I mean I've had I've had a couple close ones but <clears throat> I've won every game I played tonight which is crazy fun L what <laughs> yes we've been having fun going against people <laughs> in ranked this is the team that I thought of after uh, the tournament. Okay. This might have been perfect. <laughs> Only thing is, I have to try to be faster than that Flutter main. Let's see what they get here. Uh, special attack went up. Honestly, I think I need a Tailwind to be sure. So we're going to Tailwind. And then we're going to Eruption. Yeah. Yeah. I might get my first loss. I haven't gotten an L yet. Okay, they withdrew. That's fine. <coughs> if they don't Terra with the Goldango, and Goldango doesn't have a Focus Sash, it's dead. Just outright. Okay, they do Terra. It's probably Fairy, is my guess. So, still going to do good damage. Or normal. Okay, that's fine too. Um, I'm doing eruption, so. <laughs> There's my tailwind. Only thing here. Nice wire management back there, lol. Hey, don't look at that. Um, <laughs> I got like three systems plugged in there. Yeah, they're going for the uh, typhlosion, so. It wasn't long lived, but it, it was. It was good. It was good. <coughs> it lost some HP. It might be dead. It killed itself! <laughs> oh my gosh. That is perfect. It was a life orb Goldango. And it killed itself because I brought it down to enough. That's awesome. <laughs> they messed up. Here's the Whimsicott. So I'm going to Terra here. They're going to have Fake Out, I believe. So we're going to do Bleak Wind. And then I'm going to Terra, Flame Charge, Whimsicott, just in case. But I have a feeling it's going to be a Fake Out, Incineroar, and Whimsicott's going to use Tailwind, is my guess. 
Also by Chase. <laughs> My brother. Mi hermano. Yep, there's the fake out. Oh no. Let's see if Tailwind comes out. No. Do I hit him? Ah, oh, I needed to hit the Whimsicott. Probably a Moonblast here. Yep. So that was a good Terra. Because that does nothing. Uh, and that was a crit too. <laughs> Do another Bleak Wind. And Flame Charge the Whimsicott. Because Flame Charge is going to help Karadon get faster than anything. Um, and if we can do that, it'll be really helpful. So, order should be... Okay, Helping Hand. That's fine. It should be Karadon, then Tornadus, um, and then Incinera. Which, Whimsicott's live on one. If I hit the Bleak Wind, Whimsicott's dead. <coughs> if I don't hit the Bleak Wind... Obviously, it survives. There's a bleak wind, and it misses the Whimsicott. Ugh. Do I at least get the speed drop in the Incineroar? No, but there's a Citrus Berry. So, Citrus Berry gone. I'm thinking a knockoff is coming. Yep. Did a decent amount. I lost my Assault Vest. Do another bleak wind. This time, we're going to go into Incineroar with a collision course. And they still have Fluttermane in the back. They used Tailwind. Oh, that's right. They, they didn't have it. They didn't bring it up before. Okay. Well, Incineroar is dead. <laughs> that was a free kill there. And I think my Tailwind ends this turn. And this should kill. Yes. Okay. We hit the ones it got. So now they only have Fluttermane. And it can't Terra. So, I think we got this. Obviously, the Protosynthesis is going to go up. There's the Tailwind. So, I'm going to Tailwind here. And because of my speed boost with the Flame Charge, I should be faster. Because they're a special attack boost instead of a speed boost. <coughs> so, I think we won. So, we'll go up the Tailwind. Tailwind. And then, we're going to Flame Charge. Again see what happens see if they quit or okay they didn't that's good and now i should go first yep nice that one flame charge i think did enough to where i went first and we get the oko okay that's a win <laughs> wow this has been going really good we defeated emily good game emily <laughs> It's just been working out for us for some reason. All right, so I think this gets us to Ultra Ball rank here. We're going to continue battling until we lose, I guess. <laughs> We're at rank 10. My first time in Ultra Ball. Guys, this is insane. I, like, I literally have not gotten to Ultra Ball before. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Again, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate all the help and support I can get. It gives me, you know, just some feedback so I know if it's working or not. Uh, I apologize for any breaks that I take. I'm not very consistent with this, but when I do have the motivation to make these videos, I really enjoy it and I have a lot of fun. So I appreciate anybody that supports, whether it's a little bit or a lot, you know, you're more involved or not. I just appreciate anybody that comes by. It's really again like i said appreciated <laughs> um like i said though this video it was it was pretty cool i only lost one game out of all these ranked battles while i was streaming and actually my first time ever getting into ultra ball rank so i was i was really excited with this stream and i was glad that i got to show you guys my journey other than that i hope i see you guys in the next stream and you guys enjoy the next video deuces Bye. <laughs>